It was as if they had slipped through a gap in language and gone deep into the bush and the moist landscapes of their skin upon those epic dawns when thunder lit the bed they rocked upon, they rocked upon. In animal heat, with tumultuous heart and lung and breath, they grew dark and deep as dim as if their bodies could burst into flame. As if they could dip and rip the beads and buttons from those things which held them entwined in spirals. As if they were blue and co-equal, deep heated like honey on the tips of their tongues. They are poetic. They form a great circle. They are myth, yet solidly built. And the love they made was the liminal bridge which held them. Which held them like the solid breath of the drum. And it is the drum which calls all things to creation. And it is language which is, is it not, which speaks the origin of the world was the word. And the word was the vibration of the body. She said. When I say love, it means that I would endure a fiery death and fly over the earth with my eyes closed. But a great storm was coming and soon the room would shake, it would tumble, it would break. The rain was howling and each flash of lightning was a blade and the galvanized would rattle but the house they built would not fall solidly built upon the earth. Whole stellar cities were navigated in that gap of time diving and the deep where they were standing upon the edges of themselves. Peering into darkness which is which was the beginning of a world without end. The beginning of the end of the end of the end and he said to love, to love, to love. To love is to blink, to change the scene, to love is to dive in, to fly over the earth with my eyes closed. had pleaded with the muscle of her water and the sorrow of her eyes and the sleek black bed she had laid upon but suddenly one day he was gone oh the hardness of the world no one had ever neglected her that way she had been desired as a young woman, desired by broke thick men who could deliver the knee bend in spiritual meeting. Men who stole tools and cattle from their neighbors. Men whose wrists sparkled with silver. Desire for the roundness of her thighs, for the well of her throat, for the gesticulations of her body in agony of pleasure. She had learned to evade their territories. But he had moved south. Down to the great coastal villages of the island and could now only speak in rhymes. He would say, to love, to love, to love. To love is to build belief in invisible things transcend the liminal, to fly over the earth with eyes closed. 